we moved into this house in the 50s. We were the second family to own it. It was built in the 30s. We were over here after a storm looking at a tree that had come down and we noticed that one section of the tree had exposed something we have no idea yet what it is. It was a rock-like form and it's got carvings on it. Later on we noticed about six feet below it was another section. Could be that rock. At this point we don't know yet. We haven't seen it. Uh, the the gentleman doing the tree work has done the tree work for us in this yard for years. We've had oaks here forever. And he thinks the tree is around 300 years old. He thinks whatever was in the tree has been there at least 100 to 150 years old. Conjecture is not a clue what it is. But I can be, I can tell you I've been here since uh, the second grade, which is over 50 years ago, well over 50 years ago. And the other family moved in the 30s. And whatever's in that tree went up there a long time before that, when this was a farm. This whole area out here in Maryville was a farm. So we're pretty excited to find out what it is. Okay, Ogles has cut out enough to where we could get what we thought was, well, we had no idea what it was, uh, a piece out of a tree approximately 15, 16 feet in the air. And all sorts of ideas from the tree guys about how it got there and where it is and how long it took there. But the, but the key is, it is a type of concrete, may not even be concrete, maybe just a mortar because it's old. And uh, another thing they realized was it, it has a piece it you would think was rebar but it's not rebar it's more of a screw because this is kind of pre-rebar it also has some pretty neat lines in it like someone actually uh, made lines to make it look like the tree so if you think that maybe you had a hole in the side of a tree down low think about this so a guy could put this kind of mixture in it to make it look better and then all of a sudden you could all of a sudden 100 years later you come back and it's 16 feet in the air that's pretty much what we've got here uh, this piece we think weighs about 80 pounds and there's the the rod that would if you were doing this today you put rebar in it that is not rebar that is a, a screw and you know conjecture from uh, the tree experts and everybody 100 years something like that it took to get up there but it was over 15 feet in the air and we had no idea when we started looking in that tree we saw a thing looking back at it, it looked like a tombstone of course all sorts of urban legends popped up but uh, the truth of the matter is it's some sort of a mortar and it started low in the tree and it climbed it over a they say a hundred year period. So we're tickled to find out what it is. You want to buy it? <laughs>